Hi, welcome to the three minute drill for the Fujifilm X-H-S2 and related cameras like the new Fujifilm X-H2. That's a lot of words. So we have been creating videos for the Fujifilm X-H-S2 that are very long and technical. We thought we'd make it easier for you and create a series of three minute drills where you could learn how to use your camera without having to browse through chapters in the video. These drills also apply to other Fujifilm cameras but are more specific to the Fujifilm X-H2. Hi, my name is Vaughn. Let's start with today's drill. How to set white balance. For this video, I will use the camera's auto white balance, the Kelvin temperature option, a gray card, and as a bonus, an Expo disc. Let me show you how to turn the white balance on. First, you'll start by pressing the white balance button, and that'll take you to the white balance screen. For this video, we're gonna start out with the auto white balance. Most first time camera buyers use their camera's auto white balance, which examines the scenes in your photo and tries to use a color temperature, also known as the Kelvin temperature. But sometimes the camera gets confused if there's nothing in the scene that is white or close to white, if there is an abundance of one color, or if there are different types of lighting. Basically, auto white balance can be unreliable. I'll take a photo. That looks great. The next option in this video is the good old Kelvin temperature. This has been around since film. This is how Kelvin temperature works. You use a Kelvin temperature chart to figure out your temperature. In the studio, I'm using lights similar to household bulbs. That's 3200K on the chart. So let's go into that. We go to Kelvin temperature. And so we're gonna set it to 3200. I'll take a photo. Looks a little hit and miss, but don't despair, I have an app for that. I will leave it in the description below where you can download this app. Okay, I'll put in this Kelvin temperature and take a photo. How's that look now? Next, I'll use this gray card for a custom white balance with a white balance card. I'm gonna press the WB button. I'm gonna go to one of these customs and then I'm going to put the white balance card in front or the gray card and then I'm going to make sure it's properly exposed and then I'm going to take a photo and it should say completed if everything's good but don't forget to hit the set button by pressing OK or it won't keep that setting now you're ready to go now, wasn't that easy using this white balance card? Do the colors look better? Here's a more detailed option. It's called an Expo Disc. You can use this for your white balance. It's used the same way as a gray card, but it covers your lens with a disc. With this option, you stand by the subject as you take a reading of the light hitting your Grogu or Baby Yoda and Mando if you have one. Let's take a photo. That looks fabulous. Now let's compare. Leave your comments on which photo looked the best. Please subscribe and thank you for watching this and my other Fujifilm videos.